Today we are going to see 5 best VS Code themes which are in my opinion best for coding. And I usually change themes in every 2-3 to three months because I need changes in my coding environment. And trying a new theme gives me that. So I don't feel boredom while writing code. And that's why I am creating this video so you can also give yourself the best environment. Now let's start with theme number 5 which is Cobalt 2 theme. This theme is based on blue color theme. Developers who want a cool color theme can use this. If you have operator mono or Fira code font, then it will work pretty well. Now let's see number 4 which is Night Owl. This theme is little dark than Cobalt 2 theme and it has also light mode. So if you like really dark mode, then you can use this theme. It looks really nice. Now let's see number 3 which is Synthwave 84. This theme is unique. It has glow effects for text. So when we install this theme first time, we don't get glow effect. So to enable the glow effect, press Ctrl plus Shift plus P or Command plus Shift plus P and write Enable Neon Dreams and then restart the VS Code. And see, we get this glow effect. Now if you want to disable this glow effect, then again press Ctrl plus Shift plus P and write Disable Neon Dreams and hit Enter. Now let's see number 2 which is Dracula Official. This theme is very popular theme in VS Code and it is downloaded by 4 million plus users. This is nice and colorful theme. I really like it a lot and maybe I will use this theme for my next tutorials. Now let's see number 1 and my favorite theme which is AU. This is the theme I used in every tutorial because it's not so bright or does not have too much contrast. It is very simple and has nice colors. And this AU theme comes with 6 different color themes which cover almost all developer choices whether they like dark, light or soft. So these are my 5 best VS Code themes. Comment below your current theme or in your suggestion the best theme you ever used. I really like to try your VS Code themes. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you soon in the next tutorial.